Hey everybody, this is Dr. McGuffin, and today we're just going to talk about the main features of the Universal Notes homepage. So if you look over on the left-hand column, you can see that we have four icons. The first one is Topics, which is going to, of course, get you to the over uh, 4,000 different topics that we have uh, in Universal Notes. Uh, the second one is Question Bank, which, of course, takes you to the Question Bank, where you can answer um, one of over 2,100 different practice questions. The third icon is note cards, and this is where you can go in and create your own decks. And um, this is great because obviously you can uh, help quiz yourself later. You can, uh, and we'll talk a little bit more about note cards in a, in a different video. And then lastly is your normal vowel labs, which um, you can click on, and it will give you all of the uh, labs that you'll typically see uh, in the uh, board questions. Uh, moving a little bit to the right there, you can see um, on uh, my screen that we have a uh, little GIF, and this is showing that I am level 10, and my uh, category is a Bush Leaguer. Uh, with Universal Notes, as you advance levels based on the number of points you get from answering questions and doing various activities, uh, you get different GIFs, and uh, your little icons will change and they um, are animated, and kind of a cool, fun thing for you to continue uh, to reach for. You can see that I currently have 2,125 points, and I am 41% of the way to level 11. Moving to the right, you can see updates. Uh, we post updates um, every so often to let students know what is going on uh, with Universal Notes, and so you can check that regularly. And then on the far right there, you can see we have earned badges. And we have both basic science and clinical badges that you can earn. And uh, every one of our questions and our topics are categorized according to uh, the different subjects that they are involved with. And as you complete questions related to those topics, then you'll start um, earning levels of badges. And you can see I have some ones and some threes and even a four in there. And some, that means that I've done uh, many more questions uh, in those uh, successfully. Below that, you can start to see the chapters, and we have 32 chapters of information from which you can uh, begin to study. Uh, if you go to the top right, there's our search bar, and when you search in Universal Notes, you only are searching the titles. And so when you put something in like diabetes, you're not going to get every single place where diabetes is mentioned in Universal Notes because that would be unnecessary and overwhelming but you will just get the topics that we have labeled uh, with the word diabetes. So this helps you to narrow down your search pretty quickly. Right next to that is, of course, your logout button. And then down below in the blue bar, you can see that there's also some gears. And if you go into the gears, uh, you can go in and change some of your uh, information as far as your school and uh, your passwords and so forth. Um, and for faculty or administrators um, that work with students, they also get an extra privilege called user progress reports. You will not see that as a student, um, but that is only something that we have for our institutions and our institutional partners so that they can track down student progress as you all work through Universal Notes. So that is a general overview of our main homepage and uh, Check out our other videos where we will go into more detail about what you can find when you go in and use some of the other features of Universal Notes.